A couple of years back, a couple of kids on our team, I know Luke Esposito, Thomas Aiken, Ryan Bagoon were you know, communicating with uh, Liv Steiner, and uh, it was a young girl, her parents, and uh, you know she just finished chemo uh, pretty recently, and uh, they were participating in the Jimmy Fun Walk, and for us, it's uh, we're fortunate to do it just as a as a team. It makes you uh, understand, be appreciative of the opportunity you have, and it kind of works both ways. Obviously, you know, for her, she gets a you know a good support, and for us, we kind of get some support too from her and a little inspiration. So you know, obviously, when she comes around and she's at the rank or at a game, it obviously puts a little smile on your face. You know, to see her supporting you, and you just want to help her out. So uh, I think it's been good for both of us. You know, we've kind of both benefited from it. Harvard for me offered everything I wanted. Obviously, you know, academics is, you know, one of the best there is in the world. And, you know, to go here and come to a great hockey program as well is kind of uh, the best of both worlds for me. So I think it was a pretty easy decision for me. My two years before this gave me a lot of experience, you know, uh, not only on the ice, but off the ice, how to handle, you know, your schoolwork and your academics to go along with hockey. And, you know, obviously, uh, you play in some big games too on the ice. Dishes it off. Got oh. it back. He scores! We're in a great position here and very fortunate to be able to, you know, attend Harvard and play hockey. But, you know, there are kids that, you know, may not have that opportunity and, you know, might have a harder path at, you know, life and, you know, having a good life. So I think just for us, it's made us more appreciative of, you know, everything we have and, you know, to be able to help them is uh, it's definitely special for us.